It is Monday of Holy Week. I'm in New Harmony, Indiana, standing beside a sculpture by the Jewish artist Jacques Lipschitz, The Descent of the Spirit. Lipschitz escaped from Nazi-occupied France in the 1940s, and here in America, he created some of his most important work. During Holy Week, we are journeying towards resurrection. We are remembering the story of Jesus and how that led through times of enormous conflict, betrayal, endings, death, and how it moved towards radical new beginnings that could never have been imagined. I invite us this week to journey together towards resurrection, to allow ourselves to imagine what resurrection would look like in our lives and world, and in particular to imagine what a risen Christianity would look like, rising in a radical new way to make an offering for the world's blessing. Not a Christianity coming again as it has appeared in the past, but a risen Christianity like a seed born anew from the earth. The Lipschitz sculpture provides us with a key. It is the sculpture of a spirit descending on an abstract divine feminine form, which is opening to give birth. Now at one level, Lipschitz is pointing to the Jesus story, conceived by the spirit in the womb of Mary. But at another level, he is pointing to the universe story, that everything that has being has been conceived by the spirit in the womb of the universe. In other words, everything is essentially sacred. If we were to move towards that belief, if we were to turn that creed into deed, that belief into action, in the most important relationships of our lives and world, we would be journeying together towards radical new beginnings. We would be journeying towards resurrection.